of the morning to you from K Hug. I'm not doing internet or social media. I'm a dinosaur and proud of it. How did that work out for the dinosaur? You've been my sidekick for how long now? I'm sorry, real fast, you say sidekick? Uh, okay, my number two. The word you're looking for is partner. Saddle up, partner. We got a show to do, eh? <laughs> So you may know Dave Coulier best from his role as Uncle Joey on the classic series Full House, or more recently Fuller House. Now the veteran comedian is returning to television with the new show called Live and Local that starts streaming on the Pure Flix platform on July the 7th. And Dave joins us live this morning via Zoom. Hello there, my friend. Nice to see you. Good morning. Thanks. How is everyone this morning? Morning. Good morning. We're we're doing okay. So you're uh, you are a radio talk show host on this uh, new series. I just wonder if this is inspired uh, by the many idiot radio talk show hosts who have interviewed <laughs> you through the years. You know, when you're in town doing some stand up, us included, by the way. <laughs> well, you know, uh, throughout all those years of doing press. Uh, you know, I've had lots of characters to pull from, that's for sure. And this character is kind of the curmudgeon -y side of uh, some of those characters. But um, it, was, uh, it was a real challenge for me, especially, especially because they built a real functioning radio studio for us. And I had to learn how to work that doggone board. And that was, uh, that was a real challenge of uh, walking, talking, and chewing gum, I'll tell you. You know, I got to tell you something, Dave, just, you know, looking at you talk, you look so healthy, so great. Uh, what's going on uh, w with you? Uh, well, I've been sober for uh, two and a half years. I guess maybe that has something to do with it. Uh, and, uh, you know, I've, I've changed my eating habits. I've tried to, uh, you know, be more conscious about nutrition and uh, still playing ice hockey. Still yeah. out there with all the, the knuckleheads. Yeah. Who is, who is, other than yourself, who is the best celebrity hockey player? Oh, boy, that's, uh, you know, Jason Priestley was pretty darn good. Oh. What do you yeah, know? he was, he was a good player. Do you guys yeah. allow checking? No, no, I, I try not to play in any games where there's a referee because guys <laughs> just lose their minds whenever there's a ref. <laughs> so, Dave, we have to ask you about the loss of your dear friend Bob Saget. I just can't even imagine. I mean, as shocking as it was for all of us to hear about it, you have been friends since you were 18 years old. How, how are you doing, and uh, how is it? I mean, it, it's, it's got to be unbelievable still. It uh, was definitely a heart punch. Uh, it's been uh, a year for me that uh, I will never forget. I lost uh, my brother, Bob, and my father all within uh, oh, the past gosh. 12 months. And so uh, it really uh, is an awakening when you lose people that you love so much. Um, Bob and I, he was my brother. And uh, we were pretty inseparable, and we started as comedians. We were we were nobodies, uh, just working at the comedy store and the improv, and you know, touring there in Chicago. And uh, you know, we really grew together on Full House and became TV stars. And uh, you know, it's a friendship that um, you know I will keep alive in my heart forever. And he's one of the funniest, sweetest people I've ever known. You know, I miss I, him. I, I read an interview, uh, Dave, where, where you uh, had talked about how this cast of Full House has been through so much together, so many ups and downs together, including Lori Laughlin uh, going to jail because of the college admissions uh, scandal. And you said that she was the last person that you would ever think uh, would get into any kind of trouble. Who would be the first person on the Full House cast <laughs> that you thought would get into trouble? Uh, the rest of them. <laughs> yeah. All, the rest of us. Yeah. yeah. Well, it's got to be exciting having this new show. It's live and local. It debuts July 7th on the streaming network Pure Flix. And Dave, next time you're in town, you got to stop by it now that uh, restrictions are lifting here. It's good to talk to you again. Thank you. It's just good not to have that beard anymore. It looked like an Etch-A-Sketch blew up on my face. <laughs> <laughs>